Increase your standards in love. Some guys are afraid to go after the most beautiful women because they feel that they aren't worth their time or they lack money. But I say pursue her because a man can always increase his income, but a woman can never increase her beauty beyond a set amount of time. Now, word of caution, though. Make sure her inner beauty reflects her outer beauty or you'll regret that relationship for the rest of your life. Relationships between men and women can be summed up in one sentence. Women set their standards too high for men, while men set their standards too low for women. For this reason, I encourage men to set their standards for women high enough so that even if they don't get the gal of their dreams, they won't have to settle for the women of their nightmares. Most guys usually find out the hard way that if they aren't choosy when it comes to a mate in the short term, they will regret it in the long run. You see, if you don't choose a woman with high standards, then you will just spend the entirety of your relationship increasing her standards while she works on lowering yours. Once that woman chooses to walk out on you, one day, she will leave with those monies, your resources, and all of the time you invested in her. Now wouldn't it be better to go for the type of already put together woman that a woman chases in a man? A woman who has herself together long before she meets you can help you grow in wealth, health, and happiness. This woman can bring forth children that will not be an embarrassment to you and the world around you. And should she ever desire to leave a relationship one day through divorce, at least she would have helped you attain that wealth instead of sitting by passively watching you struggle to achieve it. This is why so many average women complain that major celebrities, athletes, and entertainers alike have women who leave and take half their money with them. What these women neglect to understand is that it is these women who helped achieve this man's money to start with. Now sure there are just as many cases where celebrities choose women for beauty and no support that take half the income, but this is no different than the average man doing the same. The average woman of lesser means, all the way up to the woman with proper breeding who lives in the Hamptons, can give you a rather extensive list of the things she wants in a man. On the other hand, the average man, all the way up to a billionaire, can write on a slither of paper the standards he has for the woman he will share his bed with, his wealth, and his life. The average man's standards are, must be tall, blonde hair, blue eyes, must have a nice rack and a slim waist, loves to have sex all the time, all day long. If a man chooses a woman based solely upon these standards, she will most certainly depart the relationship as soon as the money runs out. The separation or divorce for these women usually gets triggered once the man wakes up to a higher sense of deservedness that has nothing to do with those shallow things I just named for you. When a guy lives with a woman and wants her not to be nasty around the house, nasty with his friends, or with his parents, she has a problem with that. She has a problem with him because up front, he didn't state his intentions in a relationship beyond her beauty being the table. These type of women are not going to stay around and pick up their own mess, cook for the man or themselves, or be responsible for anything they say or do. So if you are going to seek love the second time around, you might want to take a page from any woman's playbook and list exactly what you want from a mate. Beauty is the most important. But so is living with someone who enriches your life and soul. So choose wisely and set your standards way too high for the average woman who will seek a bachelor's pad as a free place for room and board. And remember, women set their standards too high for men, while men set their standards too low for women. Why do you lie to tell